Hey guys, so this is here bringing you another video. Welcome back to uh, Iron to Diamond, the series that we take a Smurf account, Fresh account, never played around before, and uh, take it from Iron to Diamond. Again, just to remind everybody, uh, this account started uh, after placement game number one. I believe it was 84 LP uh, Iron 1. So this account was officially Iron. Um, and we're now Silver 4. We were on that little bit of a lost streak. We won the last game, which was really nice. Nico! Um, and we still gained over 30 LP. So if we win this game, we'll be in promo. And it'll be very interesting to see if we skip... If we skip, like, a division or skip the promo. Um, that would be interesting. So, yeah. Right, so we're against a Nico of all champions. Well, probably. Again, it could be Nico support. There are some people that are playing that. Uh, but I doubt it. So, we'll play... Uh, we'll try and do a donated pick. Uh, also, I, there are some champions that we have played. Like, we did a Diana game. I think that's all for now. Okay. So, it is Nico support. Wait. Oh, it's Twitch jungle. Really? Okay. So, it's Ziggs mid. Do we have... Is Lux donated? Ba -ba -ba oh, she is. Cool. We can play Lux. The reason for Lux, if you're wondering, is look how squishy the enemy team comp is with the combination that we kind of want to stay away from them. Lux is obviously perfect for that because it's the it's the two, like, I'm going to stay away from you but also can one-shot you if you get caught by my Q. Mwah. It magnifies. I didn't even say that right. But it's just, it's the, it's the perfect combo of champion against what they've got. Even Renekton, a relatively, like, has to run into you kind of champion, I can catch him with my Q pretty easily too. So it, it works quite well. Um, because I don't think I'm going to die to the Ziggs in the 1v1, I'm going to go teleport. It is risky, because if I get ganked by Twitch, I could just die, but we'll do it anyway. Uh, but yeah, let's get into it. We're playing Lux in the mid lane. All right, welcome to the loading screen. Uh, so odd that the Renekton is bronze one, but he potentially is a smurf. Because it does look like he's got a 67% win rate on Renekton, I think that is. Oh, no, no that's total. So he's got a 67% win rate in total. So that's probably a smurf. Because, you know, here we've got a 59% win rate. That's my total amount of games. Uh, so negative win rate, gold player. I'm against a Ziggs player, but there's no information. But you can see, again, good KDA. So And these two are duo. Ah, oh, it's a smurf duo. That's what it is. So, yeah, both have good KDAs. Both have got good win rates. It's a Smurf duo. Again, I've never got the concept of, you know, you're a Smurf. I, okay, like I Smurf. You climb very quickly, etc. But then you're Smurfing with a duo? I don't know. Uh, so this guy does seem that he's bad with Twitch. He's got a 20% win rate with Twitch. He's lost three in a row. He's potentially auto-filled and he invades. Uh, okay. And then Jin Casual, potentially also auto-filled. Uh, Fiddlesticks casual, NASA's casual. So it's, it's just basically a game with very little experience. Uh, but obviously, if I'm against another Smurf, we don't know what rating the Smurf is. We don't know how good he is. You know, I'm technically Diamond 2 at the moment. This guy could be Challenger. He could be Master. He could be Platinum. Like, we, we don't know. Uh, but yeah, let's get into it. We're playing Lux in the mid lane. All right, welcome to the game today. We're playing Lux in the mid lane, which is a donated pick. In order to win this game, honestly, I, our late, their late game is scary. They do a lot of damage, but also our team does a lot of damage in com like against them, specifically against their comp. They're really squishy. Um, Milaman, welcome, man. Uh, but yeah, they're really squishy. So this shouldn't be too hard to like one-shot people as long as they don't get incredibly fed. So, yeah. Either. What happened to the QT? Uh, it's still going. Again, we're running that QT for a little bit, you know, quite long. Again, if you guys haven't checked out the QT, remember we are doing a $100 right point giveaway on the QT to just talk everything about roll ranked. The positives, the ben uh, the negatives, anything you like. Go on the QT, find the roll ranked. I'll, I'll link it in the description. Um, but yeah, we're running that basically for this month. Um... Because one, it's a lot of Riot points. But two, obviously, we want to get as much data as possible to then send it to Riot. So these two are pre-made, so I don't have to be worried. Also, I, the, the Twitch does seem to have quite racist clan tags, by the way. So if I remember, hopefully I do, we'll throw a report on that. Again, usually the people that are, are have those 
clan tags are just teenagers that try to be edgy. Which is a little bit, you know, unfortunate. Guess I have to be careful actually for the level 2 gank. I just remembered. Mumu's doing a level 2? <laughs> okay. We knew it was coming. Oh god. I will say the only issue that I've got with a fiddle support is they either, either usually get really fed or feed. There usually isn't an in-between. You saw a rioter with a, an L9 clan tag. Yeah, that does disappoint me that some of them are like trying to be buddy buddy because like there are people in L9 that have given death threats to people and then there's riot kind of going, oh, we're L9. Look at us being cool. It's like, that's not a very smart move for your employees of a company to like be affiliated with a club like that. It's just, I just find it disappointing. Oh, God. Hopefully we don't have a repeat of like them just kind of crazy feeding because again you don't have a late game if you feed the whole way in early game okay let's just play passive oh late I think mid lane is just going to be a relatively far B lane. But again, I'm fine with that. But Twitch has been mid lane a lot already. Again, focusing on survival. I'd rather him come mid lane than any other lane because I trust myself to like survive his ganks more, I guess. Sometimes that's the positive of getting ganked if you trust yourself. How do you give how do you afford to give everyone in the QT hundred bucks? That's not what? <laughs> that's not what? There aren't people that think that. I hope. Oh god. No, it's a giveaway that you get if you end if you put a comment on the queue to you get entered to win. Like what? I think that's the first time that anybody's ever misinterpreted one of those giveaways. No need to flash there. There was because if Twitch flashed, I would have died. Okay, and we're back to the backseat gaming. <laughs> I love it. It's the one negative of Twitch, is that I love streaming, and I stream, obviously, so I'm not completely isolated when recording, but... Ugh. It sometimes is annoying. Yeah, we just really need the bot lane to stop feeding. They stop feeding, I think we're okay. Also, he wants to do dragon now. I think we need Jinx. He's level three. Oh, God, this is going to go bad. This is going to go really bad. Jinx just based. All right, we got to just try get this. Like, what is he thinking? He, um... No, 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 no. Uh. NASA still has all. At least we got the Infernal, I guess. He's 
died four times. I just hope that the game can go long enough that we can actually make a comeback with our comp. Because our comp is, like, as comps go, like how comps work, our comp is really good into theirs. They're all so squishy. But, damn. Facebook is ending their contracts as streamers. Uh, I wouldn't be surprised. It, to me, again... I, I, I've explained in the past why streamers did it. Uh, it's a no-brainer when a company offers you kind of crazy money to stream. Um, because in our industry, as a YouTuber streamer, you don't have any guaranteed income. It doesn't exist. So if a company goes, hey, we'll give you X for streaming, it's really nice. Um, and it's really rare for that to happen. Like, for example, recently I've been a little bit ill and I haven't streamed as much. I've lost a lot of income because I haven't been streaming. But if I was with Facebook, for example, it's guaranteed income. But the reason why I think Facebook probably is cancelling their contract is because there's nobody watching over there. Like, there's streamers that had, like, a thousand viewers on Twitch. If you actually look at their view account on Facebook, it's, like, 20. Like, it just hasn't really worked. I think it's mainly because Facebook, the trust in Facebook has gone. With all their, like, you know, privacy issues. People don't really want to be on that website anymore. Yeah, you'll notice, by the way, in this game particularly, we're playing passive because I know the win condition. Um, I know the win condition is just get to the gate, get, get later. I don't know what's exactly been happening in bot lane. Like, if it's been Fiddle just getting caught or if he's been actually trying to fight. I don't know. We haven't been watching. Um, but, yeah. We, we Again, this game is still winnable. I know the score is 0-6 and everything, but it's still a winnable game, most definitely. Again, just by the basic premise of how our comps are. Another inferno. Okay, just wait there. Oh, buddy. Uh, Pol Polcara for life. Thanks so much, man. All right, Twitch chat. What element? Even, there's not a clear winner. I see it, I think, water more than anything else. Right. Yeah, we're not going to dilly-dally. We're just going to pick it. Do you think they're doing it? Did I... I did muck that up. But we're okay. Really close. Let's make him stop. Wait, Amumu's getting caught? He wasn't trying to do dragon alone, was he? No, no, no. We don't want this fight. We don't want this fight. Because Twitch is probably around. And even though there's four people here, like, fiddle, fiddle, go back. Go be... Like, just go back, but th that's why he's died four times. 
He's being over greedy with like staying when he should just be going back. That's why. Okay. We worked it out. Again, Nasus will eventually outscale the Renekton. So again, it's the game of patience. Uh, Dragan SRB. Welcome, man. We could look for ba Dragon soon. Do you have a ward? Oh. An hmm. enemy has been slain. Oh. He's done it! Again, I can't really stop a, a fizz. A fizz? You're not a fizz. A Ziggs pushing. Again, these two champions are similar, but the one advantage Ziggs does have is he's a lot better at pushing in and stronger auto attacks. If you're wondering, like, why would you play Lux over Ziggs in any capacity? Um, I have more one-shot potential later game. Like, Ziggs still has decent one-shot potential, but Lux has a bit more. That's unfortunate. You can see, though, I nearly one-shot Twitch. My damage is starting to get there. That's a free Infernal. That's a free... That's great. Would it be nice... Like, I could have flashed Autoed for the kill, but then I probably would have died to Ziggs. Uh, FG Pixie. Welcome, man. Hello. The taste of noms. Flavoured sweets. Thanks very much, man. What flavour are the sweets? I feel that's an important piece of information that you're holding out on us. He's got cleanse up again, though. This guy just stays in mid. Whoa! My bot lane died. <clears throat> Damn it. Again, they're 0 2 0 5. They're having a really bad game so far. And again, I think the premise of why they're having a bad game is because they just haven't understood our win condition isn't them winning lane. They don't have to win lane. It's completely fine. And people have to realize that in climbing, it's okay to do certain things. And one of them is you don't have to win lane. Hey, I think the Nasus, by the way, probably would have been completely fine. I don't know if he would have got the kill, though. He might have. But, why not? I've got teleport for a reason. And that's to use it. These boots were meant for a walking. Wait, I'm 3 and 0. Nice. Again, he's got more farm than me because I just haven't been able to deal with the push. And he's mainly been staying mid lane, like, the whole time. Like, I've been trying to do these, like, one-off roams here now and then. And, to be fair, Twitch was a hero quite a bit in the early game, which was annoying. It's annoying as well, though, that... I know I'm saying that word too much. Um, he got a lot of tower plates. I think he got three. I got none. So that means even though I'm ahead, gold-wise, we're probably even. Like, he's a little bit ahead on farm, obviously. And then he got three tower plates. So one kill. Eh, it's going to be very close between us. Where's the Twitch, though? Haven't really been seeing the Twitch that much. I don't want them to overstay in top lane. Especially with Nasus being at basically no mana. Uh... 
Ähm. Hallo. Oh, my day! How did he manage that? Please. Yes! <laughs> oh boy, this fiddle is, uh, again, don't want to say anything too negative, but, uh, you guys. Yep. An enemy has been slain. We'll leave it at that. That NASA's damage. <laughs> I think I've got to realize that when bad things happen, I don't really need to mention them that much because you guys know it happened. <laughs> like, that's something that I've learned recently. It's like, as we saw it, it's like, okay. As long as we're uh, all on the same page. These boats were meant for walking, and that's what I do. Why do they have this in their own jungle? Like, this Amumu has, like, never invaded the Twitch. Also, the Twitch is getting surprisingly strong. Oh my god. <laughs> what a guess. <laughs> That was a complete guess. I was like, I wonder. They know I'm here. Do you think they'll be waiting in Tribush? Yep. They were, they were waiting in Tribush. I guess we've got, like, on-point dragon control. No! I forgot it's a Ziggs. Balls. My bad. Completely forgot it was a Ziggs. Again, that's another strength of that champion is the tower, tower control. You leave him for two minutes, your tower's dead. You're like, oh. I thought they were there. Dude, I'm doing quite well with guessing where the enemy team are this game. Yeah, just wait there. Wait, wait there. Wait, wait, wait. Because Twitch might come for me. He's either going top lane or he's going to come here. Oh, he went in the top. Oh my god. I couldn't get away from him. He still had flash after that. That sucks. Did I duo last night on my main account? No. I don't duo. I said the I might duo this season, but the only other time I'm gonna duo is when I'm at a rating that I'm like I'm content with. Like if I finally get master, then I'll be open to like master alone, by the way. Then I'd finally be open to like doing more. But I I mean I'm in the camp that I believe that if you want to deserve the rank, you need to get it yourself. Um, so if my goal is master, I want to achieve master by myself, and then I'll duo. Because if I duo for the first time and then get master for the first time, then in my head I didn't deserve it. I know everybody thinks differently, that's fine, but that's just the way that my mind works. Like, I think it was, um, again, Red Mercy, really cool dude. I think Red got to master promos by basically 99% doing, and then he did master promos by himself. He probably did the master promos by himself because he, he probably knew people were like, oh, you just duo to get there, which he did, but he did the promos by himself, which, you know. That missed. I went for that because I wanted the blue. Alright, what what colour next? Dark? I don't know what that means. 
I don't know what you need to do for the two elements. Air. Which one's air? Oh. I want to one-shot the Twitch. I want to show him, you know, who's boss. What am I? Where did I go? Ice. People lied to me. Ice, baby. You can slowly start to see our comp is overtaking theirs, by the way, because like I mentioned, just how team comps work, our comp actually has a lot of strength compared to those theirs. They're all so goddamn squishy. Uh, Solar Warrior 10. Welcome, man. I don't like how, like, invady my team is, though, alone. Like, a Fiddlesticks, who is 0-5, probably shouldn't be invading alone. You know. Just as a general PSA. Five Ds of dodgeball. That, that, that damn dodge. I was really sad. I heard rumors that they were making dodgeball too, and then it turned out not to be true. He is really overstaying. That's the whole enemy team. Yeah, he really shouldn't have been doing that. But whatever. Oh, well. Oh, the minions walked right in front of me just as I was about to. Hmm. Probably should go back and buy. Please. My team just need to learn when not to be kind of crazy. And we're okay. No, just back out, please. Like, no, no, please, 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 please. Please, please, please! Oh my god, I dealt so much damage. <laughs> Wait. Oh, there's Susan. I'm going to be honest, I kind of forgot there was a Nasus in this game. Thank you. I did so much damage in that team fight. Didn't get in a kill, but did damage. So the enemy team are basically now coming into the problem that they're too squishy to, like, go for extended fights on us. And I don't really think they can... The hell is he building? Um, I don't think they have anything to deal with the Nasus. Not really. I don't know what that Amumu play was. Like, again, when you ping people so much, like, go back. I don't know what goes through their head of, like, wait, go in? Like, no, no, go back. Go in. Like, it happens a lot. <laughs> Did I just miss everything because I was reading? Yep. Missed everything because I was reading Twitch chat. Nice. Is 
Is he building a bloodthirster? That missed. What? He was very ballsy to continue walking on that path. Obviously ballsy enough that it cost him his life. What are these people doing? I don't know. Oh, Jinx, why? Why, why, why? You don't need to be. Oh, no, no. Okay, she just straight up murdered him. Never mind. Uh... Okay. So what won this? But the, what won this game, by the way, is team comp. Like, weren't we? I think we were six and zero down at one stage of this game. Enemy team is just too squishy to deal with ours, basically. Which is again why le why team comps and stuff are so important. I don't remember, like, well. If you're wondering, like, if, if I had to change that enemy team comp to be relevant, what would I change? It's obviously, like, people probably know, but I would ch change the Twitch jungle. Twitch jungle just makes teams imbalanced. It, do it doesn't bring balance to a team. You either win really hard or you lose really hard with Twitch jungle. Um, so, yeah. I'm going to give it to the Nassas because he played really solid. Like, he just bided his time. He knew he'd be out scaling and he just waited, which is great to see. All right, so, okay, so unfortunately we don't have enough, uh, probably because the, you know, four losses in a row, we're in promo. But that doesn't mean we can't skip. We actually can still skip. If we win this promo, especially if we go two wins, um, we could skip all the way to silver two. It, 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 you can, it can happen. Uh, we went 916, farm. We got an S. I am also going to report the Twitch because uh, of his clan tag. Uh, racist clan tag. Uh, which is also that. There you go. Um, but yeah, pretty solid game. And again, hopefully people realize that most damage is the game. Um, the way that you predict how a game is going to go a lot of the time is just looking at the comp. Um, that we were losing this game really hard. And I kept saying, just hold out. Our comp's better late game. A lot better late game. Uh, so we did. And we won. So, yeah. And Mumu had a pretty rough performance. But so did the fiddle. But he did okay damage. Wrong person. No, it was the twi it was this guy. That's the guy I reported. Uh, but yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, throw a like on the video, comment down below, and I'll see you guys next time. See ya.